Hey there, Doug Grady, author of The Ripple Effect. You know, when I speak to corporations and for conferences across the country, some of the feedback I get consistently is that the message is not just very powerful, but also very simple. I mean, heck, the subtext of The Ripple Effect is that one simple choice can change the course of your life. But you and I both know that simple isn't always easy. In fact, there are a few things that you and I do to make simple more difficult. The first thing we tend to do is to dismiss it. You know, we've heard this before. There's a sense of familiarity. Familiarity breeds contempt. Contempt leads to dismissal. We may forget a simple truth. You ever meet somebody and two seconds later you forget their names. We can forget the most powerful and profound and simplest concepts and truths. Heck, we can forget if it was a left or right that we were supposed to take at the intersection. At least I do that. Uh, I was traveling with my wife about five months ago in to a national park in New Zealand. And as we uh, came into this place called Fjordland, the sun was obscured by the clouds and wasn't coming through. There was finally a break in the clouds and it came through and it was absolutely beautiful. There's a picture on the blog if you want to check that out that was taken from the ship. And, you know, this reminded me that the sun's always shining, whether we see it or not, whether it's blocked by a mountain or uh, the earth <laughs> or a cloud or some other obstruction, the sun still shines. Simple is simple whether we obscure it or not. And how do we obscure it? Well, we obscure it with our own fear and uncertainty and negativity and other negative emotions that cloud or block simple from allowing simple to work and to affect our lives in a positive manner. This leads to complication of simple. You know, the brain may say, to us, we hear something or we see something or we know something and the brain says, you know, it just can't be that simple. And so we complicate or distort or morph a simple truth into a series of complex, meaningless steps along a pathway of futility and nothingness. These are all specific ways of a catch-all way called resistance. You and I put up resistance to simple. We put up resistance to truth. We put up resistance to one choice that can change the course of our life. Hey, recognizing it as the first part. In fact, right now, if you could just take a look at an area of your life you want to have a change in. Maybe it's your health. Maybe it's your uh, level of vitality. Maybe it's something with regard to your business or your family or maybe your faith. Just look at where is a simple truth, a simple concept, one that maybe you've forgotten or one that you, maybe you've dismissed, maybe one that you have complicated, you've made it harder than it has to be, or maybe you've just blocked it with some form of cynicism or limiting belief in your own mind. What's one of those things for you right now? What's a simple truth, a simple choice, a simple concept, a simple task that you know could make a difference? And what are you doing with it that keeps it from making that difference in your life? Know that you have the power to let go of all of that crap and cut through and allow simple to do its work, which is change your life. So I'll leave you with one simple truth, and it's this one simple choice can change the course of your life. Stop dismissing. Stop forgetting. Remember it. Act on it. And take action. Choose to change the course of your life right now.